up, ten, hop. Square. This is in honor of Memorial Day, obviously, and Fleet Week. And let me tell you something. We're going to talk to two of these Marines real quick, but as someone who served in the Marine Corps for eight years, I get cold chills every time I see the, the, a band like this perform. We have the President's Zone, obviously, up in D.C., but this is the Quantico Band. These are the Marines that also get their hands started, too, right? I mean, you have to deploy Sergeant Dempsey. Yes, sir. And Sergeant Dawson. Yes, sir. All right, I want to talk to you real quick. Now, you're the one with all the decoration on right now, but you've got this in your hand. What is this, and what is your position? So, I am the drum major for the Quantico Marine Corps Band, and this is a mace, and this is a sash. Okay, so I have been in, the, in a parade with Marines, and I've seen a drum major take this and do amazing things with it. What are you doing when you're marching in front and telling this band where to go, basically? So, everything that the band does has to have a signal. Yes. And the mace is how you signal the band to make sure that they know what's coming up next, be it a turn or to cut the music or to start the music. Listen, as a Marine, I learned to drill with a rifle in my hand. I could not imagine marching with an instrument I'm playing in my hand. Sergeant, when you joined the Marine Corps, did you know you would be in a band doing this in front of important people? Uh, yes, I did. Every single person here had to take an audition before we even rose our right hands to join the Marine Corps. Uh, so all of us were recruited specifically to play. Now, what I didn't know was all of the uh, amazing opportunities I've had, uh, this being one of them. Guys, right before they play, they call them to attention. They bring their instruments up. It's an amazing thing to see. The amount of discipline is phenomenal. 
Gunnery Sergeant, I'm aware of John Philip Sousa, probably one of the most legendary uh, Marines when it comes to music of all time. Uh, I want to say Stars and Stripes Forever, The Washington Post. What type of legacy exists with music in the Marine Corps? It's a very historic legacy. Uh, it started all the way back when uh, the United States Marine Corps came back into existence and they formed the President's Own with uh, fives and drums. And it's just carried on that same tradition all the way through into today. Guys, we are so lucky to have them here today. You have no idea. As a Marine, I'm so excited. They're in a position right now where they can't talk, but I'd love to give them a real big hoorah. Sergeant, Gunnery Sergeant, to the whole band, thank you guys for being here. And we're going to toss it on over to Ashley now for headlines. Hey! Up! Ten! Huh.